Hello everyone. This week we are doing a quick tour of our milking barn. This is a merry-go-round type parlor where the uh, cows get on, they do the circle, and then they step off again, um, all in a continuous motion. The As the cows get on to our barn, they will have a, disin, uh, a sanitizer sprayed on their udder. Then a person will wipe their udders clean. And the second person will then attach the milking machine. This milking machine um, mimics the calf's um, sucking of the milk. So it actually sucks the milk out, doesn't squeeze it out. And it goes around and there is a sensor on the on the machine that whenever the flow has dropped it will automatically take the milking machine off then uh, then when the cow's done milking the uh, cow is sanitized one more time with a, a dip kind of a sealant and she goes back to her milking pen where she spends the majority of the day the milking process itself really only takes about five minutes and we do that twice a day. So there's a little bit of time waiting to come into the barn and then she gets milk for five minutes, then she goes back to her pen. And the majority of the day is spent in her pen where she has access to feed, water, her sand bed where she spends most of her day lying down. So that's kind of a, a quick tour there. Some, some other interesting facts is uh, the cows give about eight gallons of milk per day. Uh, just an average number. There's cows that can give uh, twice that amount and there's some that give less. So this is where the milk comes in and it goes through these filters. They're just like the soft filters. And then uh, I would say feel the pipes and you can feel the milk. It's uh, almost 100 degrees. It's 98 degrees body temperature. And then that milk goes through our heat exchanger and that milk, uh, it goes in at 98 degrees and comes back out extremely cold at about 36 degrees. So just right above the freezing point is where we keep that milk. And then it gets stored in our tanks, which continuously stir the milk so that the butter fat doesn't separate out. And we have three of these tanks here that we can, uh, that we can uh, alternate. And then each one gets washed after the milk's been picked up. Well, thank you so much for joining us today on our Dairy Dialogue. We, uh, we hope you follow us on social media and keep buying the milk. Also, I uh, hope everybody got the memo that eggnog is out. And uh, yeah, have a, have a good week. We'll see you all next time.